It is the age of stone. An odd worshiper kneels before you. Oh God, our scholars cannot decide which is the more important virtue, humility or confidence. Humility. The scholar bows so deeply that when he rises, his forehead is covered in dirt. One thousand years pass. It is the age of noble castles. Your worshippers constantly reflect on their inadequacies. A mortal shields their eyes from your radiance. Oh powerful one, when I misplace my toys, my mother always says that an elf must have moved them. Is my mother right? Are elves real, or, a lie? They are real. The little boy seems terrified. He says, I must go and protect my belongings from the elves. <laughs> One thousand years pass. It is the age of steam. All of the finest literature is published anonymously. The city is fortified with thousands of steam-powered pressure-sensitive elf traps. Mostly, they only kill rats, but people are glad to have them as protection. A loyal follower creeps up to your altar. Oh Lord, my wife uses a kind of shampoo that makes my eyes sting. She says it is important to have clean hair. You tell me, is shampoo bad? Or good? I missed that. Oh Lord, my wife uses a kind of shampoo that makes my eyes sting. She says it is important to have clean hair. You tell me, is shampoo bad? Or good? Good. The man hangs his head in sorrow, and goes forth to wash his hair. One thousand years pass. It is the age of skyscrapers. The financial district is full of long-haired investors trading shampoo futures. The only acceptable garment is the humble sackcloth. Soldiers patrol the streets with powerful smart guns, ready to train them on an invading elf. At a moment's notice, someone approaches your altar. Oh heavenly protector, I like to eat the flesh of lobsters. However, my brother says that lobsters are just big cockroaches that live in the sea, and that everyone should fear them. Who is right? Are lobsters food or foe? Lobsters are food. The man cheerfully goes forth and forces his brother to eat the flesh of lobsters. <laughs> One thousand years pass. It is the age of cyber, tiny shampoo droids now shampoo everyone's hair all day long, without stopping. Shampoo tech is more advanced than space exploration, or even farming technology. A popular new brain mod removes the capacity to feel pride. <laughs> Microscopic elf sensors are all the rage this holiday season. Everyone is wiring their home with thousands of tiny trip wires. Eating lobsters is now illegal. A sentient lobster has been elected to Congress in Massachusetts. A small figure bows to the ground. Oh majestic one, cats disgust me. They are cruel and withhold affection from me. But my father loves cats. Who is right? Are cats cruel or kind? Cats are kind. The woman says, thank you for your help, holy one. I will learn to love a cat. One thousand years pass. It is the age of interstellar flight. Sentient cats now work as priests in your temples. Humans will bet <laughs> the sacred touch of the cat. <laughs> Star captains export rare shampoos to aliens. Your shampoo commandments spread to the furthest planets. <laughs> Bragging lands you a solid decade in space jail. <laughs> Earth has finally located the planet that elves must come from. Within a year, they will launch their attack vessels to obliterate it, and humanity will finally be free of the elf curse. <laughs> Mankind shares Earth with a race of wise and powerful lobsters. Most religious leaders are now lobsters. You survey all that you have done. And you see that it is good. 
the end. 